Anywho, we are here as the Giants look to, uh, you know, get back on the right track, if you will. You know, since 2011, they have made the playoffs three times, including two World Series titles in 2012 and 2014. A lot of people thought they were going to do it again in 2016 when they made it, but they lost to the Cubs. I think it was the NLDS, if I'm not mistaken. So, ever since 2016, though, these same New York Giants have been under 500 every year, including the shortened season of last season, going 29 and 31. So, there is work to do. There's going to be a lot of work to do. I look forward to going on this uh, very long journey. Every single game will be streamed. Every single game will be uploaded to the YouTube channel unedited because uh, I just... I don't have that kind of time to edit cool stuff like some people do. But um, also every Sunday in the game, I will be uploading an episode of the Dynasty by the Bay recap, which you can find on, as of right now, only three uh, podcast platforms, but I'm going to do my best to get more out there. Uh, where we'll give you a recap. If you can't sit through the streams or you miss the streams and um, you know you just don't have time to watch them on YouTube, you could check out that podcast and you can learn uh, everything that you may have missed in the last week of games. So, without further ado, let's just hop right into it. I think I've talked enough. <laughs> Gotta wake the Xbox back up. That's new too. Playing on Xbox, man. This is uh, this is strange to say the least. Let's let's cut my camera a little shorter here. Nobody wants to see me. They want to see gameplay. So we're going to do our best to get gameplay here. So yeah, this ought to be fun. I don't know how this is going to play. I This is literally one of the first times I've turned the game on since I've had it. Um, the first time I turned it on was to make sure my settings are right. Uh, now I am playing with default... This camera is killing me. I am playing with default sliders because I heard if you adjust them, you don't get XP, which is weird. Um, so I don't know if anybody can confirm that for me or not confirm that for me. Uh, but yeah. Let me pull something up real quick here. It seems like we are having some issues. There we go. Okay, no, we're good. There it is. Alright, anyway. What edition did I buy? I didn't buy it. Uh, it's on Game Pass right now, so I just waited for it to come to Game Pass. Uh, I would, I wanted the uh, to go all out and get the uh, Jackie Robinson edition. But when I bought the Xbox, I got the S, which is all digital. And uh, obviously they don't have that version with the digital. So I was just going to get standard. Uh, but then Xbox was like, hey, hey, don't do that. Guess what? We're bringing it to Game Pass. So you don't get XP. Oh, that's, see, that's lame. I I'm just going to go with default sliders for now and see what happens. And then we'll just adjust as need be. Uh but when it comes to your basic difficulty, pitching is on legend, hitting, uh, pitching, hitting is on Hall of Fame. So, um, should be fun. Pretty much the same exact settings as I had in the Cubs franchise when it comes to difficulty. Pitching on legend, um, hitting on Hall of Fame, because my slow reaction time and my bad eyes cannot hit on legend. So, um, what else? Uh, franchise rules that I used in the Cubs franchise do apply here. Um, for those who don't know what they are, I don't have a command for them, but I'll probably put them up on social media so you can understand uh, these rules that I have. Um, I'll go. I guess I can go over them in time, but yeah. Anyway, this ought to be fun. I, I haven't played a single game yet, so um, and I also also know that I did say that I was going to uh, use pinpoint pitching i'm gonna start with meter and then i'll switch to pinpoint at some time in the future so 30 team control no um i'm gonna i'm gonna test i'm gonna test uh, how good the logic is i've heard it's crap still so uh we'll see we shall see but anyway i appreciate y'all stopping in game appreciate the resub coach uh if you if you don't know who crazy coach is he's part of a large group of scout scoops gentlemen uh, that play MLB The Show with different variations of the game. 
Uh, you know, some of them play franchise, some of them play road of the show. A few of them been tinkering in Diamond Dynasty. Uh, Coach is the one that made the uh, Dynasty by the Bay theme uh, for this franchise. So if you want something cool for your franchise, hit him up. And you can follow him, of course, at twitch.tv slash crazycoach. He is in here as well. Coach, you should be able to put your link in. If not, I'll put it in for you. Uh, because I'll be honest, I have it streamed in 17 days. So I don't remember what I have activated and what I don't have activated. So, um, but yeah, okay, enough talking. Let's just hop into it. Um, I actually made a blunder already because I've been so excited. Got some headphones this year. Yeah, do I look more professional now? I'm just kidding. So we'll see how this goes. I use them for PUBG all the time. So if I talk too loud, you guys just let me know. So. All right. So Kevin Gosman is going to be our pitcher today, and we're going to face Marco Gonzalez. Um, like I said, I haven't really looked at anything. So I'm just going to be kind of crash coursing myself. So don't be surprised if I uh, pull some switches here. Okay. Yep, that's right. We'll just keep road. Beautiful T-Mobile Park. Love the stadium. I think it is gorgeous. Uh, broadcasts. They got any? Nope. Just the show theme and MLB Network. So nothing new there. Apparently they got the roof closed. So we'll just leave it closed, I guess. Broadcast. Yeah. What's up, sweaty boy? Uh, sorry, my dude. I just play franchise. But uh, feel free to ask anyone else in chat. can't hear anything in these. Do I even have the volume up? I do not have the volume up. So let's try that again, shall we? Boy, I'm telling you. I'm going to scrub it streaming, you can tell. There we go. Headset assigned. Yeah. Apparently I didn't have them on. Not only did I not have the volume up, I didn't have the darn things on. So. Alright. Oh, Lord. Oh, yeah, DH. Crap. All right. Didn't set my lineup beforehand either. Well, this is interesting. Okay. I kind of like these cards. At the same time, I kind of don't. Uh, Kirk Casale starting? Really? Why don't you have Buster Posey starting? You, you animal. <laughs> Brandon Belt at first. Okay. Interesting. Okay. Brandon Crawford's not starting either, I guess, because uh, righty's up, so... I did, Gabe. I uh, I accepted it. Don't really have a lot of speed on this team, it seems. God, no speed at all. 66 is our highest one. That's not even close. All right. All right, here we go. I'm so excited. Probably gonna stink at first too. So. Yeah, I think that would be something they would throw in. It's like, oh, by the way, you can't change sliders. So. We are under the lights this evening as we get you set for another edition of Baseball on the Show. Opening night here in this brand new season between the San Francisco Giants and the Seattle Mariners. Where's the crowd? <laughs> Hi again, everybody. It's finally here. Welcome to our special opening day edition of Baseball Don't on tell me the, the game's show. already breaking. Joined by Dan Plezak. And Dan, as we get things going this season, it's pitching that has to be key if this team's going to have success. 
Just like any team, pitching is going to be a key factor for this ball club. Five oh win, huh? Plays out. I'm sure the staff will have its ups and downs. It's a crowd. But is this the cardboard like cutout can, edition? I think this team is going to be pretty successful. The date that's been circled for weeks is finally here. It's opening night. It's the now show. Now I have to automatically check my and settings. It's coming up next. Where is the crowd? <laughs> Maybe everybody has an extreme moment of silence for the, the Mariners or something. I had to turn off the... Uh, I did have to turn off the music because of how strict Twitch is about the, some of the music. But uh, they should have turned the crowd down, though. Marco Gonzalez gets the call to pitch edition. here on opening day in front of the hometown crowd. Yeah, What's we're very... We're very advanced here. Uh, we like... Hello? Crowd? Hello? Hello? <laughs> what the hell, man? Alright. I see that. That turns on. But... Turn off inside the show, by the way. Hey, All right. I don't know where the crowd is. Guys with one pitch, and that's that powerhouse sinker. Guys often relate oh. them to like trying to hit a bowling ball. When it's good, it's usually this game's already broken. We haven't even done a pitch yet. It's really easy to figure out if he's going to be on. If in the first inning you see a steady diet of ground balls and keeping right, so what his got here? involved, there's a pretty good chance he's going to have a rock solid sinker, game. cutter, curveball, and change. From the stretch, here's the pitch. Donovan Solano is in to start things off here as he looks at a call. Uh, let's turn this down a little bit here. What's up? This is Mark DeRosa. You're a little, a little too loud there. Should crank the crowd all the way up, but we're not going to do that. Strike. It's nothing in one. Yeah, so I don't understand. Um, SDS, you got something for this? <laughs> Some audio glitch or something. Little tardy on that swing as it's well wide of first. <laughs> well, the key for him on the mound is to keep the ball down. Certainly, hollow of the knee or lower. Sinker changeup guy, if he's going to succeed against this lineup, he's swing keep and a miss. The ball down. And this is swung on and missed on a great and that is that a strikeout for Solano. On strikes to get this one started. Well, I'm get another look at that beauty of a pitch right there. You can't spot a sinker in a better Part of me wants to restart because I just do don't want to go through a whole game without a crowd. That textbook sinker. Stepping up to the plate, Mauricio and DeBond's going to hit one. In the air out towards left center. Nice play. Make the play. Who is that? Who's that in center for Seattle? The Bond got a hold Francisco of one, but Giants line up in this one. Mark, what do you have on this lineup as they go for their first win? Yeah, you take a look at this lineup they're running out today, and they got their work cut out for them with the sinker baller on the mound on the opposition side. They're gonna have to see right, so the here's ball Austin they're Slater. They're gonna have to work the home plate umpire. Can't be given four to six inches off the inside half, or he's gonna have a field day. Corner call. Steve Rock one. Should be interesting to see. Hit 282 last year right in a very shortened shoot. season. If Five homers, seven one. RBIs. First chance for him here in the top of the first with nobody on. Comes set and the 0-1. Swing and a miss at the Below sinker. The zone, a swing and a miss. Good pitch. You have to find a way to lay off that low sinker. There is just no way to do any damage. You're just check looking at either a bruise shin or a ground out to the left. Uh, I really hope there isn't one. It's supposed to automatically update, so. Oh, and two count. Here's the pitch. This is We're going to ground out the first. first. And he'll step and on the back. And a one, two, three the for the Giants. Over. So a relatively routine start for the top of the first here. Now it'll be the M's turn. No score. I mean, I could check, but I'm afraid that if so I check and it says, yeah, there's an update, I'm going to be like, well, it's just going to have to wait. <laughs> All right, so we got four seam, splitter, slider, and a two seamer. Wow, this feels different. Oh, this feels different. Okay, it's going to take a second. 
I don't think they announced any patches, though. I just heard the servers were crap, but, I mean, that's kind of to be expected. Swing and a miss with the splitter there. Nice pitch by Gosman. So this is on Xbox One S, not on PlayStation. Nothing in two count and, the and we're going to start off our year with a strikeout. Gosman with the K. Let's double check our settings here and make sure our difficulty is where it needs to be. That's just a real tough pitch for a hitter to pick up out of a pitcher's hand, so they end up chasing Man. when they're in for Freaking Bieber with a complete game already, huh? Hall of Fame and Legend. Okay, it is. All right, cool. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, yes. Yes. Okay, everything's where it needs to be. Ball one to Crawford. Bases are empty, one man out. Lofted in the air out toward right center. Center fielder on Oh no. He takes the turn and heads for second. What happened there? What happened there? Dubon, what are you doing? Struggle that time for him in center field, and as a result, he'll be tagged with the E. What happened there? Runner at second now as a result of the error. And that'll He is our center fielder, right? Yeah, he is. Okay. I don't know what happened there. But uh, an error to start off the, the year. <laughs> it's not a good way to begin everything. So here's Kyle Lewis now. Runner at second, one out. Ready to deliver. Here comes the first pitch. Buffard leads off second with one gun in the inning. Ball and one strike to Kyle Lewis as we look to work around the error to begin our year. Usually not a good thing when the when the first ball put in play is a uh, an error there. That's back up through the middle here, and that is going to score the run. One up in Seattle, just like that, man. Nice piece of hitting by Lewis. There's Kyle Seeger now. Two forty one last year, nine homers, forty RBIs. Not a terrible way to have a shortened season. like to me he hasn't quite found that release point so far here in the first inning yeah yeah that's true I didn't even notice yeah at least got crowd noise back <laughs> swing and a miss two balls one strike I didn't even think about that <laughs> Not going to get two. 
settle for one. That was kind of a high degree of difficulty play that time. You see the off balance throw to second base. Good job by Solano. I would rather get the lead runner. Here's Mitch Hanniger. Alright, so 63, 61, 67. Okay. Ooh, Ty Francis up next. Okay. Mitch Hanniger, the next to bat. Fastball right down the pipe. That's an interesting game. Away. It does feel different. Um, I feel like I have to be a little more calculated in my fielding. Let's see if we can catch this one. Yeah, we got it. Yes, he's got it, and that'll end the first, but the Mariners... An RBI single for Kyle Lewis after the error. So one run on one hit, one error, and one man left on. One nothing Seattle after one. Mike Yastrzemski digging in. Yazzie boy. Out in the top half Let's see what we can do with you, man. Two ninety seven last year, ten homer. First pitch. Quite from Baltimore in 2019. Didn't know that. Fouled Fouled off. Out of the way. For Mr. Yes. Got some nice perks there. That's the time. That's what I want to see right here. One two. It's one and two. I struggle so much lefty on lefty. I don't know what it is. And a good there. Nice pitch. Let's get that sinker working, man. Second K for Gonzalez. Next here is Wilmer Flores. First offering on its way. Ooh. He is painting those corners. Keep down the Dodgers and Padres as this is the latest starting game. And a foul We are gonna pop it up. And he'll stay with it to put it away as they get their man here for the second out. Marco is going through this here. And that'll bring up the big bat of Alex Dickerson. He'll work on keeping this top of the second alive. What's up, Rowdy? Now the first pitch. They're on a new journey. All the no strikes. San Francisco Giants franchise. How you been, man? It's been 17 days. that one go by and a ball being called you could rest assured he knows he's not getting away with another one of those i guarantee you my he's dude stealth on this next with the raid my alerts were turned off because i was using it for the hot takes podcast i will get that there it is two and one appreciate the raid stealth michael stacks thank you for following Welcome. Welcome one, welcome all. Now the pitch. Swing and a miss. Justin and Ray, what's up? This is not PS5, this is Xbox One. Yes. Xbox One S. It's fun. This game really feels different. <laughs> How are you guys? Stealth, how was your stream, man? 
I was lurking around before I started. What's that breaking? Well, you don't see it all that often, but this might be a good time for a 3-2 change. If he can look oh, wow. We're just swinging that real quick. He's got it. Throw to first, beats him easily, and the side is retired. Yeah, buddy. Giants down in order. They're on Did the that raid not go through? Let's replay that, because... Should work. There it goes. Should get recognition for raiding. Appreciate it. Still... Yeah, it didn't help that my very first play, put in play, we uh, committed an error. So uh, <laughs> I don't know, know. I don't know exactly what I did wrong, but it's okay. It's gonna be growing pains. Hopefully, everybody's enjoying the game so far. This is uh, my first time playing it. First pitch coming. Here it is. I'm new here. Now a slider, and he gets ahead of him here. Oh, and one. <laughs> oh man. It, I mean, it feels fine. You know, uh, I don't know what else to say so far. I'm only in the second inning of my very first game, so. Here it comes. You say 40 seasons. Never know. I guess it depends on how much I get to play, right? Every game will be broadcasted. Every single one. Didn't get out high enough. Definitely tried to elevate the heater right there with two strikes, but caught way too much of the plate. Yeah, I mean, I thought about Sim in the first year. Just to, you know, make it a little more interesting. But at the same time, I'm probably going to need that year to evaluate who I'm going to keep. So, I'll admit, it may start off slow. You go to the depth chart for this team, you got a lot of contract years. A lot of players looking at their, uh, playing for contract years, so. It's the final Fantasy Cubs. Man, I hope I can make this better. You know, I've, I've taken some mental notes and I'm going to find a way to try to keep it more entertaining, more backstory. Back so, what's up, rookie? How are you, ma'am? Saw you were playing earlier as well. Mike Fillmore, one of the most consistent umpires throughout the league. Both pitchers and position players love this guy. Yeah, I think one of the best in the business. How I judge a good team. Play for, uh, we don't talk about the Tiger one. Is he consistent? Can <laughs> I count on him? Mike Fillmore is the exact same way behind the dish. Split finger pitch that's I don't know what it was. France gets his lead at first. Nobody out. It's good to be back in the saddle. Is that the saying? Good to be back in the saddle. I don't know where to put my webcam either. I feel like I'm going to... I want people to see the evaluation and stuff, but oh well. All right, Bozy, what we got here? Don't scare me like that. Brookie, appreciate the host. Love you lots. Up on Hall of Fame. My pitching is on Legend. My hitting is on Hall of Fame. Nice splitter. Swing and a miss. Second strikeout for Kevin Gosman. He's also on a contract here. I know it, man. <laughs> it's so weird to see Xbox buttons and not PlayStation. That's going to be a very minor adjustment. Evan White hitting the eighth spot. I did get it off Game Pass. Yeah, absolutely. I'm one of those people. The next batter will be Evan White. Once I take it off Game Pass, I'll buy it then. I'm PlayStation still here. It up one and 
one. Were you playing, uh... Brooke, what were you playing earlier? Were you playing Road to the Show or a Phillies game? I can't remember what you said you were playing. Yeah, I, I'll say this about the game, Ray. Like, it feels smooth. Like, uh... Not that last year... Oh, my God, a behind-the-back play. Mm. Wilmer Flores. You guys see that? Ooh, that was pretty. Um... Not like the game last year didn't run smooth, but everything feels a little more fluid so far. Yeah, I know, right? As soon as you power the game up on Xbox, the very next thing you see is the PlayStation. <laughs> I gotta see that replay again. All right, what's the what's the camera controls here? Because this will take me a second. Oh my god, it's inverted. Who did this? You need to be fired immediately. All right. I love this behind the back. Oosh, that's pretty. Ah, that's so pretty. Played Road to the Show. Hey, baby. Here's Buster Posey now, starting off the third inning here. He comes set. Here's the nothing and nothing pitch. I love everything this pitcher's got working right It's very now. weird that this Giants team starts off with four catchers on, the mound. He's got on their team. And a nice early feel for his off -speed stuff. We do not have a strong outfield at all. And now a called strike. Oh, that call. Time. Expands a bit here. It's two and one now. I think they did that to replay. I know, right? The <laughs> the invert. <laughs> yeah, I usually do my game recap screenshots, but uh, something with the Xbox now here's the pitch. that I like. Um, and I'm not saying this is an advantage over PlayStation, but when you're presenting your stuff, it it looks a lot smoother. But. And Posey hits one deep to left field. Ooh, right at the warning track. Gave it a ride. Just didn't ride it long enough. Uh, but yeah, like, I can I can capture, like, you know, with the PlayStation, you have to have a little screen that pops up on the side. Well, here, I could just go, I just captured a screenshot right now. And you guys didn't see it. I just captured one. And I think that's really cool. Like, it's the small things, you know? Oh, my God. The champion himself. What's up, my guy? Representing the Windy City. What's up, dude? Nice to see you stopping in. Episode one of many. I'm going to try to keep an episode count. Ground ball, Seeger Bear hands it, and he's going to throw it away. That's going to go out of play. So there's an error on Seeger. There we go, each team has an error right now. Do they have besides Bose, Posey and Bart? Uh, I Tromp and Kurt Casale. So, it's really weird. Watch it. Yeah, I know. I got them pulled up on my other monitor as well. Having a lot better at bats against the Mets than they did uh, previously. From the belt, kicks and deals. Mm. curve right belt pulls a foul. Good Giants evening, Robbie. Welcome in, buddy. It's going good, man. Even if I'm striking out a lot. Give me time to adjust. I'll be fine. Third strikeout for Gonzalez. Striding in is Donovan Solano. 
Yeah, I finally get time to. Vanessa's been sick, so uh, I've been uh, kind of doing everything. So you're not hitting anything off Marco. Here's Donovan Solano, struck out in the first inning. Let's see if this guy can pick him up right here. In the dirt here, but it won't skip away far enough. A part of me was waiting until the, the roster's updated, but at the same time, I don't really mind that much. Breaking ball as this runs in on him, and he has to step out of the way that time. Oh, yeah, she feels a lot better now. She feels a whole much better now. That's why I'm playing. <laughs> Here's the 2 1. That looks like it's going to be a little fly ball. Who's going to get it? There we go. All right, good stuff. So, we do not capitalize on the error. I was like, why do they have two errors? No, I just realized why. But yeah, she's she's good now. Uh, she kind of picked the perfect time to get sick because from the time that the game came out, it's like, oh, it's going to be on Game Pass, you know, on the 20th. So, but yeah, she feels good. I appreciate that, though. Hope everybody's been having a good life. As uh, we're gonna hit Murphy real quick, totally on accident. My bad. My B. My B. Early on in this game, and you can bet he's really gonna hear it. It's been, it according to my uh, Streamlabs, it's been 18 days since I streamed, so. Into the box now, Dylan Moore. Yeah, she'll take a Back to the top of the lineup here in Dylan Moore. He struck out in the first inning. Swinging to start the home first. Bieber having a complete game. Angels beat the White Sox. Swing and a miss at the two seamer. Do you rock me? Good thing he didn't make contact. Crowd has two homers. All right. Probably hit that on the ground. It could be a double play. <laughs> you breaking out the? What are you gonna start playing franchise? If you are. Swing and a miss at the slider. Slider that's cut on and missed for strike two. Yeah, guys, he's got so much respect for this guy's fastball. You can tell he was out in front on that slider. I think he goes to the well one more time with that. Out of baby, nice double play. Good stuff. That was belt to uh, Flores, back to belt. Very soon. Are you waiting for the rosters? Oh, yeah, the A's? Heck yeah, man. You would have a, a great excuse to build them a new stadium. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? I may, I may fiddle with stadium creator, but I don't really have anything planned. Necessarily planned, anyway. If possible, I would like to do the All-Star Games in created stadiums. You know, like, go to the vault and find a nice created stadium and have the All-Star games there. Now here's a yeah, swing. we'll take it. Did he go around is the question, and yes, he did, says the man in blue. Strike one. Yeah, yeah, I saw that, and I think it's kind of sad how they uh, didn't put that in so far, but keep our fingers crossed that it'll come to. The 1-1 one, one home is a fastball that misses. All right. Two out, nobody Two and one. Whew. Uh, could have been three and one. Swing and a miss. Instead, it's two and two. Hey, usually the second time through the order, you start seeing in. But they said they had the roof closed. The roof closed? But this guy's locating, feeling really good That's about it. That was closed to me. Two back to back. Off, so it's full down, three and 
Yeah. Oh, on a PS5, yeah, it's rough, man. It's a lot harder to get a PS5 than an Xbox One S or an X or whatever. Whichever version you want. Flores will ground him out there, and that'll be after three. Look at the Cubbies putting up 10 runs. So here's Dubon. 0 for 1. And this is where the frustration can start setting in on a team if they're not careful. And Marco's got me, uh, he's got me off balance a little bit. I'll admit it. The swinging feels smooth. There's another pitch for a strike and this guy's really attacking hitters well tonight, being aggressive early on. And if he continues to throw strikes like he is, he's going to have a pretty good night. Looking to put him away. Here's the 0-2. Lifted Interesting down that Chris Sale's pitching. I thought it was using real rosters. Don't be shocked. Is Chris Sale not hurt? To go a little bit I thought he was hurt. The zone. Three foul balls in a oh, well. row. He wants to get a swing and a miss on this next pitch. Here comes another 0-2. Ah, I knew it was coming. Good pitch. And he makes the throw to first. Dubon is retired, and there's one away. Fourth strikeout for Marco. So on the guys in the graphics department to put up the pitch speed comparison for the two starters. And that's a pretty wide range there. A real contrast in pitching styles. 97 versus 89 as the two pitchers' top speed. So uh, if you were to move Oakland, where would you move them? Or would you keep them where they're at? Just a different stadium. Austin Slater. 0 for 1 after grounding out in his only trip to the plate so far. Yeah, Matty, and it looked like a sinker in his last A-B that got him to roll over. Kind of similar situation right here. Similar oh my gosh. The mound. Look for them to try and off get balance, I am. Exactly the same They'll curve right down the plate. I'll swing. <laughs> Sad. To get it elevated just a little bit more. Curve. Far too inside that time solid. Off for ball one. Hey, the fish ain't biting there on that 0 2 breaking ball, but you got to be careful because this pitcher might be trying to find where I can look at his pitching stuff real quick. That's not what I want. That's not what I want either. Let's really go to his player card. Okay, well, wow. it's all right. The 1 2 pitch. Pitch in the dirt again. Two balls, two strikes. Keep him in Oakland. He's seen the a of times, so he might be looking for it. Lofted in the air. They're gonna fly out the right center. Who's got it? Lewis has got it. He's got it. A nice play there. Plays. He runs that one down. Marco looking good, man. This guy's gonna have a big year against righties. He's gotta get him going, you know. He's ready. Here's the first pitch. Mm, a little Sinker. There. No balls and a strike. Oh and one. No runs, no he has. Hits, and one error in the ball game for San Francisco. Way Another sinker in. One, one ball, one there. strike. Yeah, struck out. His first at bat. And a curveball's by him that time as he falls behind. One ball, two strikes, man, as we are continuing to not pick up that curveball. He can throw it any time he wants for a strike. Hit down the third baseline. This is a foul. Tried to poke it down that left <laughs> third baseline there. Looks like they got a shift on. Oh, 
swing and a miss got mm -hmm. him reaching. Got me anyway. They did have a shift on. Okay. No, um, I haven't. I think eventually I'm going to switch to it. I just want to get a feel for the game, and then maybe I'll switch to uh, Pinpoint. Here it's fun. Even meter feels different. This guy's been throwing the ball great so far, but it's going to be tested here. Four, five, and six coming up this part of the lineup. The 0 1 pitch. Woo! Turned on that one and crushed it. Just pulled it a little foul. Is that Bryant and right field? Yep. 0 oh, 2 count. Here's the pitch. Tried to get him to go after the slider, but it's 1 and 2. I don't really think I need to give him a fastball. Yeah, 80 power, my god. Check swing, umpire rings him up anyway. Nice job. I think that's strikeout number four for Gosman. Nice little pitcher's duel going here. Once they're committed to swinging, it's hard for them to slow their swings down, and that appeared to be the case there. They got their run. They got their one run off of a. Uh... Ready to deal. Here comes the first. Oh, it was an RBI single by Kyle Singer Lewis, but it was an error by Dubon and Sinner. Well, he punched out the last guy, but he didn't get any favors from the blue on the first pitch in this at bat. Probably should be ahead of this hitter instead. Need some confirmation of Rusty Valentine's in this game. He's my angel, Hernandez. Seager will wait on the 1 0. And he misses again here. 2 0 to the Mariner third baseman. One run, two hits, two errors on the Seattle line score so far. Nope. 3 0. I wouldn't be surprised if he had the green light here. Matter of fact, I know he's got the green light here. He's looking for something set or cut, and he's looking to do damage. Here it is, the 3 0. Two seamer in there for a strike, three balls, and one strike to Seeger. 0 for 1 tonight. Painted high and away, 96, three balls, two strikes. We are back in it now. You can bet he wants that one back at the plate right now. That's a pitch you normally see a guy drive if he has the right approach going. He's set. Here's the three and two. Now a swing and a Out of the way, it's slider. Oh, well, it hurts to see Al Mora in a Mets uniform. Swing and a miss at the splitter. Down goes Seeger. That's the fourth strikeout for Gosman. Way to come back in that like that there. In that sequence, I should say, three and zero, and strike him out. Stepping in now is Mitch Hanniger. Swing and a miss by Hanniger, 97. The first pitch fastball, 0-1. Flew out in his only at-bat so far. Halfway to 100 pitches, here it is. That's shot to the right side. I'll throw him out at first. No, we won't. Many guys fall victim to the breaking ball and want to get out in front of it. Yeah, we're going to be looking at a lot of pitching for this team. Starting pitching. Bullpen's probably going to be an issue as well. So we got to do our best to uh, try to get some runs. So here now is Ty France. As he'll go after the first pitch to him and comes up empty, it's strike one. One for one with a single so far. Yeah. 
Yeah. I miss his defense. Fly ball. We got a man there. Dickerson's got it. That'll end the inning. Well, we still don't have a hit yet. We can't start off the first game of the franchise getting no hit. Welcome back to T-Mobile Park in Seattle as we send it down to Heidi. Thanks, Matt. Between oh, Heidi, what did they do to you? The current state of the Giants lineup oh, with their manager hell. Dave Kapler, and one thing he mentioned to me was the lack of discipline. You got to be treating my girl Heidi better. He said their pitch selection has been the main reason for their struggles today, as far too often they've been swinging at pitches outside the strike zone. That's leading to a lot of soft contact and easy outs. So the focus going forward is on shrinking the zone and forcing the opposing pitching to throw more strikes. All right, Heidi, thank you. Here's Wilmer Flores, 0 for 1. He's set and the pitch. First pitch swinging. He's going to ground out, man. Golly, we are just not getting good wood on these pitches. Dickerson. Oh, what's up, Gabe? You could have asked that without using your thing. Wheels and deals. Here's the first pitch. Pop Popped up. him up, man. Murphy. Man, we are not hitting at all. He hauls it in without any trouble, and there are two away. I'm being too aggressive. I do. I like it. I know it's not a popular opinion, but I like it. It's not my favorite thing in the world, but I'm, I'm probably one of the minorities that, in the sense of I don't like watching 16 inning games. First pitch of the AB now. I really like how he's getting ahead early in the count. I was he's hitting over 300 through the 11 does, season. It holds nice. The pitch countdown. Posey's going to ground out the second, man. We have no hit through five. Giants down in order. They trail this one one to nothing. Just can't get nothing going. Set now for the bottom of the fifth. And next to battle be the outfielder, Jose Marmolejo. It's going pretty smooth so far. About 53 minutes in, and we're already through four. First pitch on the way. Jose Marmaleos, 0 for 1. Ah, there it is. He's got some power against righties. Okay. Line towards center field. And that That's going to get by DeBone again, man. Around second now, and this ball still hasn't been fielded. And this throw That's easily going to be a leadoff triple. And DeBone is not doing good out there in center tonight. I think that was the diving thing, wasn't it? Isn't that the diving uh, circle now? They changed that too. Be a favorite pitch clock? Ah. Stepping in now, Evan White. Yeah, as long as it ain't too extreme. 
fished for strike one. Yeah, I'll bet it. Hey, it's not always about filling up the strike zone all the time every inning. He's pitching well as we're moving into the middle innings, but interestingly, less than 50% of his first pitches. Ian Happ done anything tonight? Strikes. High in the air out to center field. Yeah, we're gonna get him out there. Catch made in center. Here comes the runner from third. All right, sacrifice fly by Evan White. Two nothing Seattle. Mariners getting it done. We are not. That would be Tom Murphy hit by a pitch last time, perhaps looking for a little payback. Yeah, Maddie, you're not lying. Last time up, squared right in the back. Hopefully, it doesn't stiffen up. I want to see if he can get through something right here. And now the first pitch. I didn't mean to hit him. And this is taken outside. Two seamer just went a little too far inside. Be aggressive with these hitters now. After that sack fly. Now it's time to try to get out of this inning with only one run scored. Hey, in half walked. How about that? The 1 0 home. Yeah, it seems like the first thing we need to figure out will be this pitching. For sure. Into center field, line drive base hit. Everything seems to be... Uh, I think the hitting will come to me. Now back to the top of the lineup. Stepping in, Dylan Moore. One in, one out, and one on here in the... And DeBone is not going to be my center fielder after this game. First pitch of the A.B. now. Nice play by Belt. We're going to get him back. To another double play. Longoria, Belt, and Solano do up. Cannot stand Longoria's batting stance. Start the inning with a pitch that misses off the plate. It's ball one. All right, his 14th season. Now the 1 0. It is taken strike one. Swing and a miss at the big curveball there. 73. Swing and a miss, man. We just uh, cannot hit the ball. Six strikeouts for Gonzalez. That's what happens when you don't get a chance to see a pitcher very often. That's one of the things that are helpful when you're pitching in interleague games. Pitch. It's always a good advantage for the pitcher because the hitters don't get to see that guy very often. There's Brandon Belt now for one. Standing in now, Brandon Belt. Yeah, it's one of them long swings. Yeah, it's uh. I just don't like his stance. I don't know what it is. And they won't get him to chase the curveball in the dirt that time, and it's 2-0 now. There's more RBIs than Belt has hit, so that's funny. And this will be fouled away. Of course, we're not really... This team is not really high-ranked in much of anything. Power, I think... Contact, I think it's 20th. Wow, good pitch. Or 5th in contact or something. The power's 20th. I think that was it. Did a good job to shorten up and protect the plate, and he'll have another shot at it here. I mean, this offense has struggled because they haven't been able to make the adjustment. He stayed staunch on the outer half, and these guys have not worked the ball the other way. Fouled away. Not getting stuff... And stuff down the middle, and we're not doing anything with it. All even at two and two. Here it is. And good patience to hold 
right, full count. certainly tell at bats like this one frustrate the heck out of a pitcher but you gotta find a way to stay composed and execute oh don't swing at that oh I wanted to check my swing I wanted to check my swing so bad there but I didn't do it 7k's from Marco it is man like part of it's me and I'm playing with a bad team but I feel like you have to really pay attention. Here's the first pitch. Cut fastball in there for a cold strike. Man, this guy's been incredibly efficient so far in this one. Mostly because he's getting ahead. 70% of the batters he's faced, he's thrown a first pitch strike to. He's set. Here comes the 1 1. Oh my god, are you kidding me? We're getting no hit because I can't hit anything. Like me, I can't hit anything. Not the game, me. I can't hit anything. Sucks. And now in the box, JP Crawford. He grounded out last time up. Yeah, and I'm fine with the check swings being a little harder. First offering. Gosman's actually pitched pretty well. It's just uh, fielding issues are the reason we gave up these runs. Check swing. Did not go. Somehow. Catch. Got it though. Achievement. Chopping firewood. Break a hitter's bat. Okay. I need to turn those notifications off. <laughs> thing I love about the achievements in this game is that zero of them are for Diamond Dynasty, which is something I don't play. Like, it's all, you know, franchise and road to the show. Hard hit ball to second. Got a guy there. And that's the second out. Now back, the third baseman, Kyle Seager. Got some interesting free agents out there that's... Striding forward now, the Mariners... Could go sign them. Kyle Seager, no hits to this point. They'll automatically help this bullpen. Here's Seeger. He's 0 for 2 tonight. From the stretch, here's the pitch. Now a half swing here as he wanted to pull it back, but he does. Courtesy so called by Blue. Strike one. That ball hit hard. Hang foul. Hey, right, baby. Thank you for going foul. Uh, I don't know necessarily in mind. Um, you know, there's I, I looked a little bit through the free agency market, and uh, there are some like players that don't exist or whatever that's down there, and it's your typical 19 year old A prospect type players. Trying to send them packing for the second time, and it's fouled away. But uh, I don't know yet. I'll have to figure it out and. Hopefully we don't do like the Tigers and lose 10 games in a row. Ball and two strikes here Hopefully we can get a win before that stretch. Bases are empty here with two men out. Two and two now with two away yeah, some prospects. Empty. 
this is exactly the reason why this guy has been so successful and has played this game so long. Scrambling pitch after Yeah, because this bullpen's not exactly fantastic, I guess. God, I got to get used to these ugly looking... These bars here. Go ahead, Weisler, warm up here or stretch and toss. Get him warming up. Yeah. No, nah, we don't talk about that. I don't know what you're talking about. The two -two. Bounced on the ground and right at the ship. All right. Finds its way through for a base hit. I don't know what that was about, but okay. Did I just not take the right path to the ball? Okay. You know what? I'll blame that one on me. I don't know what I did wrong, but I'll blame that one on me. Hanniger. So go after the first pitch and bounce it into Ooh, Javi hit a... Yeah, he did. Just saw it. About time he does something besides strike out. Poor Gosman. Sorry, Gosman. I want to apologize for... The way that I'm controlling the defense right now. We'll get better. We'll get better. High in the air out to center field. And no trouble for him as he makes the catch to end the inning. One left for Seattle, but they're on top two to nothing. Amish. You off work? How was your first day, man? It's quite an organ. First offering on its way. No, Gosman was our starter. He was our uh, number one guy. Man, I'm gonna get no hit. I'm gonna get no hit, man. I'm not getting anything. It's be quite a way to start off this franchise, right? Good tired. I'm so happy to hear that you're. Happy tired. That baby Slater hit it hard to left field. There's our first hit of the game right there. Woo. One out double by Slater. First hit of the franchise goes to Slater. I only got a hold of one. No, no. You get into the seventh inning, Dero. As a pitcher, you start looking ahead to what might happen. And that don't Legend pitching, Hall of Fame hitting. As well. This guy's had his A game. You can't deny the fact that he's pitched a heck of a game. But from an offensive standpoint, you never stop grinding to get a crooked number up on Here's Yaz over two. Two strikeouts. Man, Marco's been pitching real well. This game, Amish, we talked about it earlier, man. This game feels so much different. Like, the pitching feels different. The hitting feels different. The fielding is different. It has not been pretty in fielding. Gosman's actually pitched very well. It's just uh, our center fielder's gaffed on two balls. So... Second with one away. The 
Nostrimsky is going to hit that to deep left field, and that will be caught. We are going to hold up. Man, I'm just happy we got a hit. <laughs> Game's fun, though. No surprise that the uh, Dodgers won their game. Beating the Rockies. Won nothing, I think, is what I saw. Here's the first pitch to him. I didn't say that. Yeah, man, absolutely. And what a curveball. Mariners got the bullpen warming up here. Ken Giles on the right. Kenyon Milton on the left. That shoot through the right side. We're going to wave him in, and he is out at the plate. What a play there by Hanniger. Going all out on that throw. Got to try it sometimes, man. Good play. We got our hit. We got two hits, though. Giants are going to go to the bullpen. Matt Whistler coming in. What's up, no name? Love the crack of the bat hitting the ball. Absolutely. Same. We're going to see what our bullpen's up to here. First pitch on the way. That's a good start. And there's a base hit on the line. He got the pitch he wanted and he didn't miss it right there. Hammer job. I love the opening day logo that they got on the bug there. The little banners they have. It's pretty cool. So now to the plate, Jose Marmolejos. And he just gets a piece Do you guys think that was a bad foul. move to try to uh, send Slater there? Can't tell if I'm talking too loud or not. I didn't know how uh, not a bad pitch right there. That two Mitch Hanniger's arm was out there in right. Hitter. Didn't get the strike, but I like the idea behind the pitch. A runner at first with no outs here. We've got decent arm strength in the outfield, but our arm accuracies are all terrible except for one. Of course, that's Yastrzemski out there in right. Corey Dickerson's in left, and I'll be honest, man, I don't think he needs to be in the outfield. Not with the rating that he's got. A ball and two strikes now. Well, we'll see. We'll give him some chances. We'll give him some chances to see what he can do. Hey, baby. Catch Marmaleo's uh, looking. Can't say his name. <laughs> Whistler with strikeout. is all about mixing pitches and location. But he threw that all out the window to get that strikeout. He offered the same pitch three times in a row. So I guess he sort of used that. But Evan White, he's 0 for 1. His opponent. Got a sack fly, I believe, actually. So I don't know why it's not saying that. Into the box, Evan White. As he'll watch a slider that runs out of the strike zone away for ball one. It seems like to me, I don't know if anyone can confirm or deny this. It looks like the breaking pitches break a lot more in the game than last year. Maybe that's just me, but... The one -home. Swing and a miss. Swing and a miss, strike one. Runners on first with one down. Now a fastball gets the upper part of the zone for strike two.
Getting by the slider. Two balls, two Just strikes. Call, two two. We're in the bottom of the seventh. Seattle up 2 nothing. Seattle getting both of their runs mostly on defensive uh, mishaps by the Giants. The ball hit deep, but Dickerson should get he that. There, the There's two down. Out. Here's Murphy. He's been hit by a pitch, and he got a single. Here's the first pitch. Ripped down the line. What a foul ball here. I'm excited though. I'm excited to see what we can do with the Giants. It's going to be a struggle. I'm fine with that now. Especially since we're in the same division as the Dodgers and the Padres. But on the bright side, we get to play in probably some of the most... I think I think the NL West is probably the, the best-looking stadiums. That ball hit hard. Yastrzemski is going to run that one down. That nice baby. Alright. On the top of the eighth, Dickerson, Posey, and Longoria do up. Got our hits. See if we can get some runs. So now here is Alex Dickerson. No hits in two trips. Marco's still in the game. Why would you take him out? Here's the first pitch to him. Took a little off, and it's in for a cold strike one. I really like how he's been attacking hitters early in these ABs. He's thrown strikes on the first pitch to over 70% of the guys he's faced so far. And that misses one and one. Right, close to 48,000 fans in attendance here. Nice opening day numbers for the Mariners. That's going to get away. Murphy's going to teleport to the ball and throw me out. That's eight Ks for Marco. Oh man. For these two guys in our two nothing ball game. One gone here in the Giants half of the eighth. And that brings up Buster Posey. Yeah, I just hope they make sense, you know. Wheels and deals, here's the first pitch. I just want the trades to make sense. Ball two strike to Posey. Hey, Marco's been very consistent with his put away pitches. Still even in it's two a foul. And two. two balls, two strikes to Posey. Cleared off to right field. Hanniger's going to let that one drop. And Posey will get his first hit of the year. Hey, 
just a nice piece of hitting right there. He's able to keep his hands inside that ball. Stay nice piece of hitting by Posey. And feed it into the opposite field for a base hit. Hope we see a huge comeback. Yeah, me too, Gabe. Next up is Evan Longoria. 0 for 2 on his line thus far. That's all right. We'll be back tomorrow night. If uh, see if we can get a win. If we can't pull it off here. Jesus, that scared me. Loopbird, thanks for following. Appreciate you. Speed stuff to start this EP, and neither has found the zone. He's trying to pitch him backwards, but that only works if you can get them for strikes. Now he'll probably have to challenge. Nice pitch. Two balls and a strike to Longoria. You got him Better pitch. After that one, it's two and two. He hasn't thrown that pitch much all game. I gotta believe as an offense, you just gotta throw that pitch away and move on to the next one. I did too, man. I'm I'm a little not great myself. Here now the two -two. And he goes and we'll get the hang of it though. That's a double play ball though. Oh, that's rough. Alright, they go send Marco out for the ninth. They should. We're going to bring in Jose Alvarez from the pen here. Let's see here. Let's see. We'll get ready to scout out who we're going live I guess it's got to be Crazy Coach, doesn't it? Probably go there. <laughs> Nintendo Wii. <laughs> Don't worry, man. You'll get it. Here it comes. You'll get it. May take some time, but you'll get it. <laughs> 2012 on the Wii. Whew. That's a. That's quite a time. <laughs> <laughs> God, the Wii, that's a console. I actually enjoyed the Nintendo Wii. Here comes the 0-2 pitch. Changes up on him if that's in the dirt for a ball. High in the air out to center field. Dubon hey, has Dubon? it and there's one gone. Start playing NHL 21. I'm not much into hockey. Um, I hear people say it's good. Now in the box, JP Crawford. We could really use a knock here. 0 for 3 in the game so far. Here's JP Crawford 0 for 3 tonight. He's set. Here it comes. Unable to Ooh, that's find ball, huh? All right. At least partially known for a good changeup, and it's not just any change of speed pitch, it dances all over the place. To start fights. <laughs> yeah, buddy. Hey, you speaking my language. The 1 0 home sent on the ground out to second. And very quickly there, there's Ty, it feels like you really need to focus on defense first in this game. Holy crap. Everything. I feel like I'm gonna mess up every single play. <laughs> Here's Kyle Lewis, one for three tonight. Into the box now, Kyle Lewis. Oh, I'm not giving me that bottom at all. 
He's working on a one for three thus far. I'm just so excited to start playing baseball again, man. The 1 0 home misses off the plate. 2 0? Get to play in the beautiful Oracle Park. Pitch on the way. Two balls and a strike. When I broke into the league, not many guys were throwing that elevated fastball with that much. Oh, yeah. No, absolutely. The game has changed. <laughs> Out of the way. Early and now it's even at two and two. Two out, nobody on. Hope you're hoping to do giveaways this time. Really talk to people. Um, I'm still undecided whether I'm going to have a Discord channel about this franchise or not. Now another two -two. That was part of the reason I came up with the baseball. Dynasty by the Bay recap podcast. Give up a walk there. So here's Seeger now. One for three tonight. Don't exactly know why we're nervous here. Got a pretty solid catcher behind the plate. Delivery to him. Lifted the other oh, way. Sager hits it the other side. way. In there, a base hit. I see. I didn't understand that. That just cost me a run right there. I don't know what happened there. I see that. I don't get. I don't know what else I could have done there. I think that's my gripe right there. Alright, I've seen enough. Do I have anyone else I can play center? Anyone at all? God, I'd rather put Slater in the outfield, to be honest. Uh, I guess we'll just leave him in there. It's weird too because that's his that's his number one position. And yet he's crap at it. I don't understand what that's about. Yeah, Bucks would have had it. At the plate now, Mitch Hanniger. That's the first pitch to him's a change up that can't find the zone. It's ball one. Got a hit in three at bats to this point. Yeah, literally all the Mariners have to do is hit it to my center fielder. That's how they've scored all three of their runs Seager is hitting it to the bone. Apparently he just forgot how to play today. A ball and two strikes to Mitch Hanniger. Hey, this is a big pitch right here. Can't allow we'll get it. You know, it's first game. Let's see if he attacks his own or bury something in the dirt. A lot of franchise to go. All right. Cal Seager gets a lucky run. <laughs> I'll be honest. That's what I think. <laughs> Doesn't help that Dickerson has a 41 fielding out there and left, so. Like, look at that. Like, what is that about? <laughs> anyway. It's all right. We'll figure it out. Slater develops good. From the stretch. The 
one and one pitch. Misses for the second ball. A couple strikeouts early in the game, but he's done a much better job in this at bat, trying to get ahead and put himself at a good hitter's count. The two one home. Ah, good pitch. And it should be okay to go the distance here. He's just now about to hit 100 pitches for the ball game. Yeah, it's go time, Matty B. He's got a chance to close this one out. He knows the bullpen. Swing the and a miss. Belt strikes out. He's got a smile on his face. Nine strikeouts for Marco, man. Woo. Every manager loves one day where you cannot have to empty out everybody in that bullpen. Going Good stuff. The ninth inning in today's game with your starting pitch. Here's Solano, 0 for 3 tonight. Started a sweet double play in the second inning, though. Stepping in now, Donovan Solano. As he'll take a breaking ball in off the plate for ball one. What's up, Charm? Three at bats to this point. Oh, he's been getting that cutter the, the whole game. He's been throwing that cutter right there. Good action on the sinker, one and two. Oh, that's 10 Ks for Marco. Man, this guy's on his game today. Not only when he's throwing strikes, but how about the amount of strikeouts? What's even more impressive? No walks up to this point. So he's pounding that zone with strikes. So here's Dubon. He's making these hitters swing the bat. And stepping in, Mauricio Dubon. He's their last Dubon, sorry. Two away in Dubon. the ninth as they look to avoid the shutout. Yeah, Matt, they just haven't had any answer for the great pitching all right. so far in this one. We'll take the sale. Be all right. Take a f couple games to figure out this team. He's going to ground out here. Crawford's going to throw him out, and that will do it. As the Mariners take game one. We use 3-0. Jumped out to an early lead in the first and never looked back. Marco Gonzalez gets the win. Marco gets a complete game shutout. Good for him. Round of applause for him. Kevin Gossman is settled with a loss after giving up only one earn. So that'll do it for us for Mark DeRosa. Good stuff. Zach, Heidi Watney, and our entire crew. I'm Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB The Show. For more, make your way over to the new website. The show Slater gets the first hit of the year here. Seager gets a lucky hit. <laughs> Oops. Oh, that's unfortunate, man. Like I said, Gosman didn't do half bad. Six innings, six hits, four strikeouts, no walks, and two runs. Uh, I'm not exactly upset with that. You know? This was the first hit. Why is everything inverted? But, a tough first game. But, Oh, we'll get it. We'll get it. Let's see here. Uh, really didn't get anything. Had a lot of strikeouts, that's for sure. Throwing error. Seeger committed an error here. God, I 
hate the inverted replay. Stop it. He sold him a PS4. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Yeah, really nothing happened here. Oh, I know what happened here. Hold on. Oops. Oh, there. Uh, what inning was that? Hold on. The first inning? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I'll show you the first mishap here. Yeah, this was the very first ball put in play. Like, the very first one. Just a fly ball, right? DeBond should have had it. Just getting under it. Camping. And he just doesn't catch it. Like, he, he has something better to do. So, oh well, I mean, we didn't do well defensively, so what can you do, right? I'll do one more just in case they didn't capture. Yeah. It's just an error, not a game glitch. Oh, yeah. No, absolutely. But he had so many misplays. But it's all right. All right. I'm one and done tonight, guys. I'm so sorry. Um, I'm, I'm trying to do one at a time, to be honest. Um, we're going to go say hi to Crazy Coach. We'll be back tomorrow night to play game two. Um, it says Alex Wood versus James Paxson, and I'll probably do that. I'll probably save Quato for Game 3 against Sheffield. So, tough start to the franchise. We did get the loss. Uh, but hopefully we'll see you guys tomorrow night for uh, Game number 2. Episode 2, I guess. Uh, but until then, we are going to go host Coach. If I can find what I did with this Strime. There it is. Oh, crap. Hold on a second. I'll get this right. If you're watching this on YouTube... Uh, if you're watching this on YouTube, thank you so much. If you've been here live watching the game, appreciate it. We got plenty more coming up. Obviously, it's going to be a long road. So, uh, might as well sit back and uh, buckle up. So, appreciate you guys. Everyone have a great night. We'll see you tomorrow night for game two.